back on Naturopat. Thanks for coming back. So many people ask me why our products are not on Amazon. Okay, <clears throat> many people, and many people have also asked me why of our products are expensive compared to a lot of the you know, ten ninety nine or fifteen ninety nine dollar. Uh, candida products on Amazon. I just had a good surf on Amazon, had a, a good look at several different brands of uh, uh, feedbacks and reviews and rating and things like that on products. And what I can't get over <clears throat> is how a lot of these formulations are put together. And you can see there's no intelligent design behind the product. Some products just dump, for example, oregano oil, a plain oregano oil, or the, even the aerial parts of the plant together with a bit of say for example garlic oil, a bit of berberine, maybe some aniseed I'll put in there or some wormwood or something and that's it. <clears throat> Other companies will have a mishmash of many different uh, products in there that don't really make sense. They'll put for example St. Mary's Thistle, Silly de Marianum which is a detoxification herb. They'll mix that up for example you know with other herbal medicines there. So there's a lot of mix mash going on there. There's no clear system online. All right? If you look at the Kanzita products, you've got the remove, the restore, the rebuild. The system works, it works together. So many people have to spend a lot of money, way more than what the Kanzita products are worth, in terms of having to buy more and more and more product, and more and more different products to get any kind of effect. So in the end, it ends up costing them two to three times as much uh, as it would than if they got the Kanzita to begin with. But the biggest thing I notice with the formulations is they're not really made <clears throat> by clinicians they're made by formulators who are totally different people from people who actually sit in chairs and talk to patients all right now how do I know that well I've been formulating for over 20 years I look at a formula I don't look at a name or a label or a person I just look at the ratios on how the supplements made and particularly what herbs are used okay what type of nutrients are used what the recommended dosages are for this product. Pricing is irrelevant. I don't look at the price on something. I look more at how it's put together. And I can't really see much I'm excited about online. And we don't like working with Amazon anyway. I mean, you'd have to know what Amazon's all about with Jeff Bezos in the news at the moment and how they treat people. And not really an awesome company I like to buy a lot of things from. So they've been in the news a lot lately too. So. But that's not my gripe. My gripe is these companies that pretend they've got the latest and greatest and best of everything. But <clears throat> as they say in the old drag racing fraternity, the BS stops when the green light drops, okay? So when the green light drops at the racing track, that's when all of this blah, 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 all this crappy talk stops because that's when the car that really makes the difference is up there ahead while the other guy's looking at his butt wondering what the hell happened. That's how I feel a bit like my Kanzita products. I don't think mine are any superior to other products, but I just feel that they work with so many people because they're made by someone who's got a big interest in the gut and particularly in cleaning up the gut. So if you look at the ratios of Kanzita, for example, how it was put together, but also the strength of the nutrients in there, the four to one, okay? So we've used a standardized um, ingredient in there to really amp the potency up that's where the cost comes from the raw materials okay getting high quality herbs um, at the moment in particular has been very very expensive for us and hard to achieve that we still managed to pull it off with our, our last dose so I'm not sure how long um, we can keep access going uh, to a lot of the raw materials we're using in Kanzita Remove but at the moment it's still working fine but I've not seen a formula like Remove at all online. I've seen several companies trying to copy this formula or make a similar one, but they don't seem quite to get their act together. Um, if I did see something phenomenal, I'm pretty sure I would say to you guys, wow, this is really impressive, this product, but I haven't seen anything really that comes close to Kenzita Remove yet. I've had several companies approach me and wanting to get hold of the formula and even relabel it. And people who want to sort of like do share profit and stuff, I said, just leave me alone. Because all they do is they wreck your stuff, you know, so it's so typical, isn't it? But yeah, have a look yourself on Amazon and give me some feedback. See if you can find a better product than Remove and show me the formula. I'd be very interested to see how the formula is put together. And I can tell you pretty quick if the person has an interest in a clinical situation or purely a formulating situation. There are two totally different processes going on there. 
anyone can grab a magnesium and put it in the bottle say here's my magnesium formula but to put 12 different nutrients and herbs together okay it's a little bit more complicated than that anyway thanks for tuning in